韓国と日本へようこそ Alright, what's up everybody? What's good?、Uh, Shampoo coming at you, of course. And、um, since y'all last seen this, let me know if y'all want to see,、uh, keep seeing these t y p e of videos, because, you know, I'm just kind of chilling on the computer doing this stuff for school. I actually got class today. And,、um, you know, like I said, this is from my capstone. So I'm just kind of showing y'all little by little as I go through it. But,、um, but yeah. Uh, I got my、uh, model into ZBrush now. I did actually、uh, do a little bit more to it than what I did、uh, before, of course. Before I brought it in here, I made it smooth and everything, and added some more details like the、uh, certain like, spikes or scales on his back. I added the, the claws on,、uh, on his feet and everything.、Um, extruded out like a jaw muscle so it looks.、Uh, You know, a little bit more beastly. But yeah, now basically what I'm trying to do by bringing it into ZBrush is to make it so that I can add、um, that higher end detail. You know, make it look,、uh, you know, take it to that next level.、Um, basically, what I'm going to do is, is that, so I have to finish this model today, so I'm going to use this,、uh, this preset. On this、uh, alpha brush, and basically,、uh, when I carry、uh, this certain preset over it, it's gonna make it look like it's a very rocky type creature, kind of like,、uh, you know, very gritty and grimy and shit. So, as you can see, when I start to carry it over, you can see it happening. And basically, what I'm gonna do. Make this happen all over it. Probably not everywhere on the、um, on it, but、uh, definitely not on the wings. But anywhere like on the stomach or anywhere on the face, then yeah, it's gonna be there without a doubt. Some places I wanted to seem like a little bit more condensed. Probably do it like right here. Kind of rocky. So his face looks really kind of like, you know, twisted up and stuff. <clears throat> and already, you know, that adds a totally new level of, of depth to this, to this、uh, creature that I have here. Here and boom, just like that. That's what we got. Now, let me see if I move it around. We get under here. Trying to get a good look and appeal to it. But I don't want it on the、uh, on the spikes that I have here, so. There we go. Whenever I move it, you can see it like kind of pixelate. The texture is like pixelate and stuff, but as soon as I let it go, it clears up. That's what you call a beast. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and do the same for.、Uh, Pretty much everything else. I don't really、um, have too much time to, to do everything I want with this thing, which sucks. But,、um, but with what I can do as of right now, you know, I have to complete this model by today. I pretty much have to. If I don't, then.、Uh, I'll definitely be,、um, 
behind schedule. Just don't like what that is. You know, just by adding this, you know, it just makes it that much more alive. So I don't, I re I'm really not trying to get it on those, uh, on these fins that you kind of see on this. I kind of want those to be there like that. But um, if you look at it, you can see that I have it so that uh, whatever I do on one side replicates on the other side. So, you know, it's not like a really long process where I got to constantly go back and forth, make sure it's okay over there. You know, it's just kind of quick, which is fucking awesome. I might need to modify a few things with the feet, but I mean, I think I'm just going to go ahead and just keep it as it is because I really don't. I'm kind of hard pressed for uh, for time right now, and I really don't have enough. Yeah, I just really just don't have enough time to do everything I want with this thing. But I think I've done uh, good enough with it for the time being. Let me take off the symmetry real quick so I can get up in here, get the. Uh, oh, let me back up to. Three, there we go. So I can get it like that. Now like that. Uh. Basically just blending everything in. I don't want the tail to be that way either. I'm gonna do something different with the tail. Um uh, let's see. Got to do the, uh, the back area right here. I'm actually using my tablet to do this right now. I'm not using a a mouse, which is a hell of a lot better. It's a lot easier to use and everything if you have a tablet. I do kind of want this to wean into that a little bit like that. I can actually go in and kind of smoothen it out a little so that it kind of blends into the wings. Then pretty much after this, I'm going to take it into Photoshop CS4 because uh, the great thing about the latest CS4, uh, you know, Photoshop is that it can actually texture your, um, your models, which is fucking awesome. Usually you would have to like unwrap them or whatever, or you have to use a program like Unfold 3D and, uh, you know, get the UVWs just so you can uh, texture your models or whatever to get that certain detail. But I mean, you can already see that just by doing that, it really makes it a hell of a lot better. That's what you call beast. But, um,. Alright, for the wings, I'm not really too sure right offhand what I'm going to do for those. So I have to decide pretty quick. Uh, but I know I just don't want them to be dull like that. But, um, I don't know. We'll see what I'm going to do. I'll show you all the final like product when I'm done. But I just want to go ahead and throw this out there. Show you, I guess, kind of the direction that I'm going in with this right now. But, uh... Alright y'all, I'm going to be making a video a little bit later about um, something new that's going to be happening on ps3living.com. Uh, so, you know, we can get 
users a little bit more involved with the site. Uh, but yeah, I'll holler at y'all later. Peace out.